What is up YouTube? I am back with another video for you guys today. So in today's video, we are working on this garage that I'll be filming most of my videos and installs and all that in this garage. I know I haven't been updating you guys on what I've been doing and how to build your own garage or whatever, but I decided to start this video late, but yeah, I keep saying but, but whatever. So we just did all the walls white and we painted their doors gray and the ceiling all done we already prepped and cleaned the floor we're going to be doing a black epoxy it's going to be very nice let me go ahead and show you this is the chips it comes with and this is the packet so this is what i'm going to be using and it's going to be looking nice i know i haven't been posting lately but i'm going to keep you guys updated and post more for you guys we also got a big build coming soon for the e36 i'm going to be turboing it really soon so I have a lot of parts in at home and I'll probably do an unboxing, which most of the boxes are already unboxed, but I'm going to show you what all I got. And I am making, a, I'm filming a video while I'm doing this as well. I'm installing my IRP short shifter on my E36. So currently my car's on jacks on the other garage and that video will be out soon, but this one will be out first before I finish that one. So yeah, this is going to look very, very nice. That's going to be painted and all the work stuff is going to be over here with shelves and some badass lighting over here. But we're going to get to working and once it's all done, I'll show you guys. Alright, so I'm currently mixing the two pouches. We have to do this for two to three minutes and kind of annoying, but I'll be grabbing the booty out now. But let me show you, so then the pouch over here. It has part A and a part B. So when you're mixing it, you have you have to push the part A and it pops and goes into part B, which I'll show you in a clip. But yeah, let's keep mixing this and then we'll begin doing all the edges around the garage and then the floor. And when you apply this, you have to do it in sections, so four by four sections and then throw the chips and stuff like that. And you can also do an additive epoxy clear over it, which you have to pour over. And then that's just a bigger process, but this works perfectly fine. I'll show you guys. And it's gonna look awesome. I can start doing some more car stuff in here. All right, guys, so we got the first layer done, which is the edges. Then we're gonna begin the four by four and then apply the chips all around until we get to the end. And then once we finish from there, we are not allowed to walk on it for three days. guys and just like that the garage is done it looks nice let me know what y'all think in the comments down below i think it looks fire but i know i didn't show the process it is kind of a pain but you have to go back and forth and make sure to not dry it out because it will get hardened over time but yeah it looks very clean and that's it for today's video don't forget to like comment and subscribe and i'll catch you next one peace